here are a bunch of ladder variations for you guys. So fast feet, um, you don't need a lot of space, you can shrink down the distance if you want, it doesn't have to be as long as this one. You want to be aiming for at least five runs in the ladder, um, and you want to have a go from three to five times on each of the different movements through the ladder. So Kenny and I are about to show you a bunch of variances, have a go at it, uh, record yourself doing it, and post it up. Have a go. Number one. Two. Number three. Number four. Ten. Let us know if you're doing a full speed. Uh, you need them broken down slower so we can show you the movements individually if that helps better or if you guys can pick them off at full speed what they need to do is throw a ball for you but here's a bonus one for you One is left foot only, second one right foot only, and the third is switching between left and right feet. If you're looking at controlling the ball from the inside to the outside of the one foot, um, you're gonna go down and back with the one foot, then switch down and back with the other foot, and then you're gonna go to, if you can, switching between each foot. All right, so here's a nice, easy drill to make sure that you're working on ball control, but also getting as many touches as possible in a short amount of time. So you want to keep it on the one foot on the way down and then one foot on the way back is just inside outside touches. You're looking to control the weight of the ball with that other standing leg. You want to have a minimum of five yards distance if you can. Um, this can be in a hallway, it can be in the backyard, front yard, on a driveway, in the garage, wherever you got available. 